Hi, my name is Zobi Amin. I'm clinical psychologist and I have over 10 years of experience working in this field with children, adults and adolescents. In celebration of World Mental Health Day, which is on 10th of October, I'm, I would like to talk about total well-being. We all know about physical pains and physical issues, but we have many myths and mis misconceptions related to mental health. Most of the people feel, why should they go to a psychologist when they are not psychotic or they are not insane or they are mentally stable? Now, what is mental health? Mental health is basically psychological, emotional and social well-being, which affects our thoughts, feelings and actions. All over the world, people suffer from mental issues like stress, tension, demotivation, lack of confidence, low self-esteem, relationship issues, lack socializing and communication uh, skills. But still, they, they don't feel it's important enough to be, uh, to be reported or to seek help on, though it affects our daily life functioning. And even though with, if you are physically healthy and you are mentally disturbed about something, you cannot perform according to your potentials. We should all understand mental health is important for children, adolescents and adults because it alters their reality, their thinking, their feelings, their behaviors and that's why it's very important. Now if we start with who should seek help, there are early signs for, uh, to seek help. You should all pay attention to those early signs. The early signs are change in appetite and sleep. Either your sleep increases and plus eating behaviors increases or they decreases or they are disturbed. Second thing is the people become, start becoming isolated. They don't want to talk about it. They feel that they won't be understood or they are scared to share about their mental, issue, mental health issues. So they won't speak. They will stop talking, interacting with their families, friends. They will avoid social gathering. The third thing is there, there are a lot of mood swings. Like sometimes they feel irritated. They will be, sometimes they will be happy. At the second moment, they will feel low and they will stop talking. They will be, there will be weeping spells. And the fourth thing is, that their behavior and emotion changes. They become more irritated, they, they, they become aggressive, they act out aggressively, and they do things which are not like how they were. You feel they are a different person. So if any of this is happening to you or your surrounding, seek help for a mental professional. And to book appointment with me, just call Rack Hospital. Mm -hmm.